Hello everyone and welcome to exam B. So in this video, we are going to discuss about the NIC previous year papers. So NIC is conducting the examination for scientist B and scientific officer as well as for the scientific technical assistant. We have released the notification video. We are releasing many content over NIC. So if you want more update on NIC, what uh, kind of a notification it is, go and watch the video. That is uh, the description about the entire uh, notification which is being released by the NIC, that is National Informatics Center. In this video, the, uh, I'm going to just to show you what kind of uh, paper pattern NIC is having and I will show you the real-time previous year questions that were asked in the year 2022. So after 2022, this is the next exam that is happening. So you can just relate to the kind of uh, pattern that they are going following, that they're going to follow in the recent trend. So for that matter, this video has been made. So you can just check how the things happen. So let's start with the video for the previous year questions. So first of all, the entire paper is divided into two parts, part A and part B. Part A is generic part where you will be having the general ability questions, questions from the quant, questions from logical reasoning and so on. So they will be like uh, the general part that you read for any other exam. You can see here the type of question that were asked in 2022. Overall 42 generic questions were asked in 2022 and uh, these all are very normal in nature. I will say not very tough. Uh, the general part is not that tough. But if you didn't have practiced uh, any uh, exam before it, so what you have to do, you have to start practicing for at least this exam. Okay, so you can see here the kind of questions that they are asking. They are asking very easy formula based question. Some are very analytical, but many of them are basically directly formula based. So you can just uh, uh, have a look on the kind of questions. Let's. Uh, see some other snaps from the paper that is like uh, here you can see there is one question which is very much relatable to the uh what you can say sequencing logical sequencing of a particular paragraph which is broken into several sentences then uh what kind of word frame and everything is happening so there is no exact uh, uh definition what they're going to ask they are going to test you on your general ability and general intelligence basically so this is part a which was having 42 questions in year 2022 now let's go to the part b so part b is technical part which will be having the rest of the paper the rest of the paper will be comprising of technical questions only that will be taken from the syllabus of the computer science and engineering and IT and you have to stick to the syllabus to get everything done so you can see here the first question is very much from the Kokomo model that is from the software engineering side on the other side you have a question that is from the compiler design that is the uh, thing basically you cannot exactly say it is compiler design or theory of automation or theory of automata do you say theory of computation it is basically all mixed up so very easily you have to just understand what kind of uh, grammar and languages understanding from the compiler design and every topic that you have read in your uh, graduation or post graduation so basically technical part is not that difficult as well but it is very wide the syllabus is very wide the level of difficulty is up to moderate they are not very easy they are not very tough but yet they are conceptual they need basic understanding and if you are just reading the things from the above you won't be able to get the correct answers because here the questions are not exactly at par to very high level but yes they are somehow very analytical and they need a crisp understanding and to the point of understanding of a particular chapter you can see some other questions which i have taken from the uh, 2022 paper so here also you can just see the kind of question that were asked um, from the dbms and other from the you can say normal function which is written in c so what kind of output is being expected if we feed this function with uh, this particular thing so it is just a basic recursion which is happening so if you know how to make happen recursion how to make recursive tree and things like that this question will hardly take your 20 to 30 seconds so you will be able to get the correct answer now all the question papers are provided in the description box you will have the direct link to download all the papers to have a look on the papers that happened in 2022 2017 2016 2018 so all the papers are there for the scientific officer for the technical assistant and the scientist to be as well so you can just check the description and you can just check the more on the 
previous year paper you can get an understanding what the kind of question the examiner is having are you able to meet that requirement how you're going to uh, tackle this particular exam and how you're going to manage with this much vast syllabus and keeping the content in mind which is going to be asked in the actual examination now if you want to have a study plan for this much boss syllabus we have released the study plan for scientist p and scientific officer and sta basically this study plan will tell you to prioritize which all chapter you need to finish at first and which all you can take care at the later part of your studies so there are the chapters which are very important which will maximally hold the entire um, you can say the bandwidth of the paper so you have to prepare them first so that particular thing is also available you can just download the pdf from the description again as i said for the other pdfs for the previous year questions you can just download it from here as well the next big announcement that i have to make is that there is a free workshop on the nic notification that everything you need to know about this particular examination by me that is jain dimishra i will be having this workshop with you all guys on today that is 11th of march at 4 pm so do registration for this free workshop ask whatever question you have related to this exam it can be any kind of question whether you're working whether you're not working how to tackle this exam if you are having an it experience if you have forget everything what you have read in your undergraduate or during your postgraduate it can be any question it can be purely technical it can be non technical as well but yes related to the exam only so for that matter we are coming together and we will have a fruitful session if you want to attend that session you have to do one thing that is register registration you have to find the registration link in the description and you have to register yourself you will get uh, the link for joining the workshop and then we can have a fruitful discussion and you can get to know everything that you want to know that you are having in your head in your head or any kind of clarity that you want to uh, just clear your doubts before you actually decide to prepare for this exam what kind of job role nic is have having what kind of profile you guys will be having what kind of uh, uh future is there with an ic what kind of a work um, profile is there with an ic so everything we are going to discuss in this session so if you are curious about any of these questions your questions will get answered here your ultimate destination is march 11th 4 pm registration link in the description box so that was all from my side for this particular video see you in the next video and also in the free workshop that is happening today only if you like this video do hit the like button if you are still an unsubscribed user do hit the subscribe button and click the bell icon so that you can get regular update from our side whenever we will come online with any of the video that is very useful for us as you are in government examination or government job aspirant so that will be very useful for you so you have to do this subscribe and hit the bell icon you will get the regular update from our side so see you in the next video till the time keep practicing